Welcome again to this episode and this series. And so today we want to talk about um, fleeing away from sin, fleeing away from the devil, resisting him. You see, as a Christians or believers, we are not called to entertain the devil. We are not called to entertain sin. What the Bible tells us is that we need to flee from sin. If you entertain sin, you will definitely fall into it. If you entertain the devil, let me tell you, he's so good at deceit. He will deceive you and will fall into his deceit. The Bible says that the, the devil masquerades himself as the angel of light, yet he is not. Remember that before his fell, he was called Lucifer. He had all this glory. The book of Ezekiel talks about him, how he was created, until pride and iniquity were found in him. So the devil, if you, if you entertain him, he'll make you fall. The book of Proverbs, uh, it tells us that you cannot uh, hold fire into your hand or, or, and expect not to get burned. A good example is the story of Joseph, and we can get that in the book of Genesis from chapter, chapter 39. If you read along there up to uh, from verse 12, you read uh, what happened to Joseph and the Potiphar's wife. When the Potiphar's wife would demanded him, Joseph knew very well that this was sin and this was evil, and that these were temptations from the devil. And what did he do? He literally flew. He ran away from Potiphar's uh, wife and that's how he got uh, his salvation. How God saved him from the peace that the devil had put uh, before him. And so we always need to flee from sin. Don't entertain. If you have uh, friends, uh, good friends, but they bring you temptation maybe they want you to go clubbing with them but they just tell you just go there you just take a soda just take a soft drink or let's just go there we will just be alone or maybe those are temptations of the devil and you need to flee away from them either it's a, it's a neighbor's wife who's uh, having an eye on you or a neighbor's husband or any kind of sin whatever even if it is at work at a, there's a temptation maybe to to take something take a bribe to, or do anything you need to literally flee from it flee from it if you entertain it he will get you you see this is exactly what happened with eve the moment the devil came to eve in the garden of eden eve gave the devil an ear he never flee from the devil from satan that old serpent who's very cunning he gave him he gave him an ear and what he did what happened he he ended up disobeying god doing opposite of what god told her and told them so that's exactly what happens you need to flee from him the bible tells us uh in the book of uh james james chapter Chapter 4 from verse 7 says, uh, Submit yourself then to God. Resist the devil and he will flee from you. You need to, to resist him. And he'll also flee from you. De resist him and also flee from him. Flee from all temptations. Flee from him. If you give him an ear, you'll end up falling. And God may forgive you, but consequences may come after you. So, I hope this series helped you. Stay tuned. Keep following this series and I know you'll never be the same again. God bless you and have a nice time.